Hi, I'm Dave, and I'm going to show you how to use the Navage Custom Cleaning Kit to deep clean your Navage nose cleaner. For basic cleaning instructions, check out our other how-to videos. The Navage Cleaning Kit is available at navage.com and includes everything you need to deep clean your nose cleaner. So let's check out what's included. You have two scrubbers to clean those hard to reach areas, a C-clip to hold the drain valve open, which I'll get to in a minute, and a U-tube, which attaches to the nasal dock to allow water to flow freely through the nose cleaner. Here are the steps to deep clean your Navage nose cleaner, and they're also included on the back of the packaging for quick reference. First, take your Navage over to a sink and remove your nasal dock and nose pillows simply by pulling straight forward on the nasal dock. Same thing with the nose pillows. To remove the upper and lower tanks, there are unlock icons on the back, which show you what direction to twist. Twist that direction, the upper tank comes off. Same with the lower tank, and you're ready to go. This is the Navage Scrubber. It's got a flat end and a rounded end, and it's custom designed to clean all the components of the Navage nose cleaner. Here's how to use it. First, go ahead and wet both ends. Then put a drop of soap on each end as well. To clean the nose pillows, use the rounded end and go all the way through. To clean the nasal dock, there are three openings on the nasal dock. There are two in the front, again using the rounded end. And then there's one opening on the back, again, rounded on. To clean the mechanical module, there are a couple of different openings. There's a circular opening on the front, so again, use the round end. And there's a round opening on the bottom. The flat end can be used for the flat opening on the side of the mechanical module here. Now on to rinsing. Now we're going to be using the U-tube and the C-clip. Both components allow water to flow freely through the nose cleaner. First grab the U-tube and attach it to both posts of the nasal dock, like this. The nasal dock then attaches to the mechanical module. Now let's use the C-clip. The C-clip is designed to hold the drain valve open to again allow water to flow freely through the mechanical module. To install the C-clip, locate the drain valve here, pull up on it with your finger, and just attach the C-clip right onto the bottom of it. Now let's rinse. There's no need to reattach the upper and lower tanks, you can just set those aside. What you're going to do is run water through the drain, and now that the drain valve is held open by the C-clip and the U-tube is installed properly, what'll happen is water will go through the drain, through the nasal dock, and then down out the bottom of the mechanical module. We recommend rinsing for about 30 seconds. Now that you're done rinsing, remove the C-clip, remove the nasal dock and the U-tube. The nasal dock will go right in the countertop caddy. The mechanical module will go right in the middle of the countertop caddy to dry. As far as the tanks go, you can rinse those out with the same solution of soap and water that you use to clean all the other components. Same thing with the nose pillows. When you're done rinsing, the lower tank goes in the bottom tier. There's space for the nose pillows. And the upper tank goes on last. If you need additional assistance, please don't hesitate to give us a call. Our customer service reps are daily Navaj users themselves, and we're here to help. Our number is 1-800-203-6400.